Hey, what's up, y'all? It's the Big Cousin Steve on that Nerf tip. Today, I got an unboxing and a review of something special. I went ahead and procured a bunch of battle bunkers, dude. So many battle bunkers that I can't even hold all these battle bunkers. So many battle bunkers that I can't even hold them all at the same time. Oh, I'm going to set, hold on, hold on. I'm going to set some of these down. Check this out. They are inflatable bunkers that you can like put in your house or like outside to have like a legit Nerf war with them. And I swear to goodness, I had a dream about these before I even knew about them. I was just dreaming like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> They're inflatable and they look tight. Like one's like a cable spool and one's like a stack of tires and one's like a wooden ammo box. And this is um, barbed wire. And you fill them up with water so they just don't fall down. Ooh. Look at these kids though, bro. That's gonna be me. That's gonna be me. And I guess they have others or a different set that has like different stuff in it. That's tight. I got um three of this this kind. So I'm gonna be stacking them up, bro. Alright, I got my knife. Let's get into it. Wait a second. These things are inflatable. Maybe I shouldn't be shoving a knife in the box. Ooh, I'm gonna set this right here. All right. But I was super careful. All right, and you get this bag. All right, so you get a bag that has, I guess all of the uh, four battle bunkers in it. And it's got instructions. And like, oh, it's got, um like a little repair kit. Oh, okay, okay. Wow, you go to the instructions, they take care of you, they tell you how to do this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, I think I got it. Cause you know, I'm on that speed reading tip. Oh! They're like, really crunched in there though. They're like, you gotta pull them apart. This up. Okay, this one looks like the top stack of tires, I think. This one, I think, is the the ammo box. This is the barbed wire. I know that because it has barbed wire all over it. And here's the tire, or not tire, but the wire spool. Fresh, bro. Okay, I'm a little bit tripping because I'm gonna have to blow these up with my mouth, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna have to blow these up with my mouth. I see that this is probably like a little uh, thing that you can put water into. So I gotta blow all 12 of these up with my mouth. Ooh. Okay, I'll be right back in a split second. All right, we back, bro. Yeah, I did grow a beard in the time it took me to blow all these up. But bro, they all blowed up, all 12 of them. Yeet, yeet. We got the cable spool, we got three of those. We got one right here, we got one here, and we got one here. So uh, yeah, we doing good on that. We got all the barbed wires, we got the ammo boxes looking cute. You know what I'm saying? We got the uh, tire stacks. So yeah, let's do some configurations. Yeah, that's a hot little setup right there. So you could, you could hide behind all this stuff. That's a good little peekaboo window. I love me a peekaboo window. I'll be like, but I am. But yeah, bro, I could really see myself hiding behind this kind of stuff. I like the barbed wire because it's see-through, you know what I'm saying? So you could just like be peering at your enemies like, whoa. You could just be peering at your enemies like, I see you, but you can't get me. I'm sitting down behind all the battle bunkers. Man, look at that though. Bro, Battle Bunkers is tight. <laughs> I love Battle Bunkers. Uh, I think my favorite Battle Bunker out of this set is probably the ammo boxes. Uh, they're pretty sturdy. You can stack stuff up on, on top of them. Uh, second favorite, man, probably the tire stacks because they just look really tight. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm loving these uh, cable spools because they got like a little peekaboo window. But I, if I was in a battle with battle bunkers, 
I could see myself having like a jolt and just running up to the battle bunkers and being like, bam, like just taking out my enemy like that. I really like the barbed wire ones. At first I didn't, I was kind of on the fence, uh, no pun intended, uh, but I really like them because they're see-through. You know what I'm saying? You can kind of be like, oh, Matthew's coming up this way. Let's bounce some ammo off then. Since I'm already rocking my red atlas, let's do rival rounds first. All right, that looked pretty tight. Uh, let's go for some elite darts. Ooh. Now let's see if the battle bunkers can handle mega darts. The mega darts were crazy. They bounced off really hard. That was tight. I was like, ooh, woo, trying to dodge them like Neo from the Matrix. Let's do Boom Co. <laughs> battle bunkers are legit, bro. Each box of four battle bunkers uh, costs about 20 bucks. It's a Toys R Us exclusive. And I really like these as an adult, so I'm sure I would have just been in love with them as a child. And I'm sure these would be fun outside too. Um, like if you have a party, like a really dope quinceanera uh, or a birthday party, you know what I'm saying? Bat mitzvah, you know what I'm saying? I think that if you want to go the inflatable route with your uh, little wars, this is your best bet, legit. I do recommend having like some kind of a pump or something to blow them up uh, because I did do all of these with my mouth and I almost passed away. So yeah, go ahead and hit that like button, you know what I'm saying? Share this all around the world, let's make it viral. Ho! And subscribe for more of that big cousin content. And I'll see you later. I wasn't ready, Timothy.